Hi, how's it going? I'm Isla Golden and welcome to my vlog. All right, okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is point out that I rearranged my set. I'm, I'm calling it a set. <laughs> it's not really a set. It's my other couch. <laughs> uh, but I've reorganized it a little bit. So like um, the hat and the bandana are on the same place. They may move to different locations and we'll, we'll see what works. Um, this has mostly been done because my mum's around yesterday because these are like, they, they fall off from me sitting down. I was like, yeah, they, they're going to be in the way. So I'm just going to move them to one side. I have these in place, but I was like, I'm just going to move those to one side and then I'll re-sort re out how it is tomorrow. Um, and I was like, well, the bandana looks kind of weird there so maybe this will work a little bit better um probably work better again once i know what else i want to sort of put into the background uh, i know it's been a long time since i've sort of really played around with stuff back there but as i was saying last time it might be a bit more interesting for me to sort of do a little bit more with it rather than just leaving it as a sort of kind of boring space although my my fnaf my FNAF obsession must remain intact. <laughs> um, so, um, as along with seeing my uh, mum's yesterday, um, the only sort of major thing I can sort of think of to kind of really talk about is the fact that I've been playing Pokemon Snap. Um, now, this will be going out like a few weeks from when I film it. Um, because I'm actually a little bit ahead and I was a little bit ahead before I had that day where I did the filming of two. I managed to get a little bit of ahead because of, um, it was like an, it was basically like when my shifts fell that particular week because I didn't have the Saturday in which to film it. I filmed it earlier in the week and then somehow filmed the second one <laughs> during the same week. Um, or well, something along those lines, and I managed to get a little bit ahead. Um, so, from my point of view, I think Pokemon Snap has been out for for a couple of weeks at this point, anyway. Um, and by the time you guys see this, it'll have been out for a little bit longer. Um, but I, I did get Pokemon Snap. I did play the original on the N sixty four. It was one of those games that. I had it, my friends didn't have it, um, mostly because my friends didn't have the N64, they had like the Playstations and the Xboxes and whatever else was around at that sort of time, uh, but they didn't they didn't have their N64, so if you wanted to play any N64 games, they would come around to mine, um, technically the N64 was my older brothers, I had several games on it um, that were my games, and it did actually, the console did actually end up in my room, along with the SNES. <laughs> So I, I ended up in possession of both of those. Um, and actually the GameCube in the end as well, which was my younger brothers. And I had a couple of games on, on his GameCube and I ended up with that one as well. <laughs> um, so yeah, uh, I had the original on the, the N64 and uh, me and my friends would sort of play it together in as much as you can sort of play that sort of game together. Um, it's mostly like we would use a photo, like we would take random photos and use a photo gallery to like, I think you could put captions on them. I'm not completely sure. I think you could put captions on them. I mean, like we would do certain things and we would try to get certain shots um, and sort of have fun and sort of play around with it. And like, it was very early memeing, like pre-meme memes being a kind of thing we would kind of kind of create memes with it um that kind of thing so of course when i heard there was a new pokemon snap coming out i was very excited um the game was absolutely beautiful i mean i know um i know it's very different in some ways from how the original one was there is a bit more of a plot to it um and you know there there are certain things that are better in my opinion um, and certain things that the game is missing which um, for me isn't a problem I don't mind that fact that, that it's not in there at all it makes sense that it's not in there but other people might be a bit like oh but I really miss this feature from like the previous version and I'm like oh. 
actually for, for what it is it's such a beautiful game and like there are so many sections where I've been going through and I've been going oh my god this is amazing <laughs> um especially because uh like the the one that kind of stands out the most to me is the the desert level where certain events will happen and the switch because I'm, I'm using it in handheld mode the switch will just rumble and like yeah it's it's uh, it's very immersive in that kind of way um no uh, yeah it, it is it's very interesting what they've done. As I said, it's a very, it's a very beautiful game. Um, and, you know, I've been playing it not every single day. There have been a few days where I haven't been able to play it for one reason or another. Um, some of that has been to do with, I've been working during the day and then that particular evening is either movie night with the friends or date night with the cute friend. Um, so then I've not been able to sort of play it in the evening, although, some of my dates with a cute friend have been with us just playing Pokemon Snap at the same time, <laughs> to be fair. <laughs> um, but some of them haven't, and certainly, like, uh, or alternatively, I've, I've had, like, a lot that I need to do on my day off. Um, I just haven't gotten around to sort of sitting down and playing it because of, of everything else that I've needed to do. Um, but I've been playing it most days, and um, at the moment, because I've, I've sort of reached the, the end of the, the game's sort of storyline, um, as it were. I'm sort of now going back and trying to clean up all the Pokemon that I haven't, uh, haven't captured yet, and trying to get like all the different star, uh, star level photos for, for each of uh, the Pokemon that I don't have all four versions for yet. Um, so it's definitely a game I can see myself completing. Um, I don't know if I'm going to like aim for like the platinum star level for every single star level. <laughs> love, love that sentence. That sentence makes so much sense. Um, yeah, I'm not sure if I'm going to actually uh, aim to sort of like complete it to that level, but I definitely want to get like four star shots for like all four star what level shots for all the Pokemon that I can get. Uh yeah, get all yeah, basically for all the Pokemon. I want it for all the Pokemon. Um I'm not too worried about getting them all to like the like platinum or whatever it is standard. I just want to have like all of their pages complete. That that would be enough for me. Um, so that's very much what I'm going through and sort of doing at the moment. Um, I may or may not have completed that by the time this one goes up, because as I said, this is being filmed like a couple of weeks ahead um, of when it's actually going to go up, because <laughs> I managed to get ahead. Um, but yeah, that's, as I said, it's, it's for me, from my point of view, it's, it's a beautiful game. It's a very immersive game. Um, like the little details and the little things that they've done um, to make the game more interesting. It yeah, it it's great. I mean, um, I would say that the cause like the original Pokemon Snap was a brilliant game anyway. I would say that um, the the biggest sort of flaw from my point of view from the original game is that you didn't have that many Pokemon in it. <laughs> <laughs> like the, I mean, it, it, the new one doesn't have all the Pokemon either, but it has a larger collection of Pokemon than the original had in comparison. And I know the original was only working really, definitely with the first generation, maybe with the second generation. I'm not exactly sure at what point it was sort of in production, but I have a feeling it was in production after the second generation, but it only features first generation Pokemon. So. But even then, it doesn't fe feature all of the first generation Pokemon. It's like, it's a very, very, like, there's 151 original Pokemon, and I think it features like 60 ish, um, around that sort of level. Um, whereas this one has Pokemon from all different generations uh, represented, and uh, that's, again, it's not like all of the Pokemon that they're. That they're could possibly be, but it feels like a much more expansive amount of Pokemon. It feels like a realistic number of Pokemon for the region that you're exploring. Um, the terrains are very interesting and, and very different. 
it feels like a, a longer and a more substantial game. Um, and there's definitely a lot more replayability to it. Um, and there's a slightly more randomised element to, to it as well. Um, so like with the original Pokemon Snap, like no matter how many times you went through the levels, the same Pokemon would always be in the same locations and the only thing that would really alter that would be how it would be you doing the right thing in order to make certain different things happen. Um, but if you did that, that certain thing every single time, the same effect would basically be like that. Whereas with this new one, you can go through a level and every time you go through the level, you'll notice something that you didn't notice the previous time. All Pokemon will be in a completely different le location to where there was before. So there's a little bit of a random number generated to what events go on during the journey. And yeah, some of the events will be the same and you'll see them a number of times. And some events you might see like once or twice. Um, I think there's one course where I've just discovered there's an entirely new area which I hadn't explored before. <laughs> um, so yeah, it's like it, there is a, a lot more to do. And I think the replayability, although the replayability with the original snap was really good anyway, there's a lot more potential for replayability um, with the new Pokemon Snap, and uh, yeah, it's it's definitely one where it's uh, definitely definitely very exciting to, to play. Very, as I said, very beautiful game, very interesting game. And I know I'm not really like a game reviewer person, which is why this is more me just kind of gushing about how much I love the game because <laughs> I couldn't think of anything else to talk about this week. Um, but yeah, that's, yeah, that's very much the, the other thing that I've been sort of doing with my time. Um, so yeah. Um, I hope you found this one sort of interesting. Um, I hope you're looking forward to seeing whatever it is I'm going to talk about next week. At the moment, I think I might do another, um, excerpt read plus whatever it is I want to do afterwards, but I need to decide on what excerpt that I want to sort of do and, and what direction I kind of want to take it in. Um, so I've got a week to try and come up with that. <laughs> um, so yeah, with, with that said, um, I will see you next time. See ya. <laughs> if you've enjoyed this video, Feel free to check out some of my others, and if you like what you see, please like and subscribe. See ya!